I was 12 years old. What I wanted more than anything else was a four-wheeler. My parents didn't have the means to provide one, and I just wanted to do whatever it took to go earn the money for a four-wheeler. I started my own business on the summer of my sixth grade year. I set up a small little firework stand, and that morphed into several other stands, but it was a great leadership laboratory for me to learn how to make change, talk to customers, interact, solve problems, and getting customers to say yes. And that's what life's about, getting whoever you're working with to say yes. And so those skills morphed into other businesses. And that's when I entered my real estate career. That turned into the land development business here in West Texas. I started out as a kid from Lubbock, Texas, selling fireworks on the side of the highway. I've now become an investor. I love helping people reach their maximum potential. Business just happens to be a conduit that allows me to do that. Well, a friend of mine told me about Lemonade Day. You know what, in order to do Lemonade Day, I want to do it with my boys. They squeeze 70 pounds of lemons. Their poor hands were as pickled as you can imagine but they had fresh squeezed lemonade and they were so proud of their product and their location and seeing the smile on their face was incredible. Come right. Oh, All right. You just lost All the right. sale. Oh, sorry. Would <laughs> you like some lemonade? Yes. We have to go teach kids how to go start businesses. It's the future of America. We're only starting half the number of businesses that we used to start 40 years ago. We're teaching kids about how to do Algebra 2 and Calculus and be all-star gymnasts, but we're not teaching kids about how to start a business. And small business is 90% of the employment in this country. And we have to teach people how to go be entrepreneurs. I realized I had to help spread this across the country. I was lucky enough to be asked to participate on the national board. That was six years ago. You fast forward that last summer at our annual retreat, the board voted and they voted me to be the new Lemonade Day chairman. And I couldn't be more passionate about it. It's really what I'm made to do. Now we're in 62 cities, two foreign countries, teaching these same skills across the world. I couldn't be more excited.